Hey, what's up? You're watching Dave, the hearing aid guy. My name is Dave and today I'm really, really happy because I'm going to do something many hearing aid customers and also many hearing aid professionals want to do, but they can't, they won't do it. And maybe, well, maybe you know all of us sometimes have these days when they use their hearing aids and they think, oh my God, all I want to do is just smash those things because it won't work. I can't hear as I wish and it's not working well at all. Well, you know, everybody has these days, but you know, hearing aids are expensive. So nobody smashes his hearing aids because of that. At least most people won't do it. But I'm pretty happy because today we'll have some, well, cutting edge season, I guess I can say so, because I brought my friend here <laughs> and we're going to see how a uh, behind the ear hearing aid looks like. And before you say, hey, Dave, you can't cut a brand new hearing aid, don't worry. This is an old phonic behind the ear hearing aid. It's not working anymore. And we got it from those here place guys. Thank you for that again. And well, before I talk too much, I'd say, okay, let's start and let's see what happens. So oh, there's some metal in there. Okay, that was that. Okay, well, that works better than expected. So let's go here to the tube. Oh yeah, great. <laughs> Sorry to say that, but I really like that. Okay, well, that's really some cutting edge technology, isn't it? Okay, just a little bit more. Ah, the battery compartment, of course. By the way, I removed the battery before, so don't worry. Don't worry about the environment or about my finger or whatever. Everything's fine. So, here it comes. Ooh. By the way, I'm wearing safety googles while doing that and please don't try this at home, of course. So, I think that's it. Okay. Well, that's the one thing. And here's the technique, as you might notice. Let's just remove this. And what do we have here? We have the two microphones here, button for the rocket switch here. There was a battery compartment. Here's the uh, socket for the programming cable, battery compartment here. And there's also some nice little technique in here. Maybe we can go a little further. Ooh. By the way, this doesn't smell too good, so absolutely don't do this at home because, well, your, your wife will hate you, honestly. So, come on. Oh, 
Okay. You see this? So we just removed this little thing here from the front. That's one of the two microphones. Nice, isn't it? So let's go on. Can we go further? Not really. What you can see here, well, this is for uh, Okay, nothing too special right now. This is for, for all those wireless things. What could we cut? Let's cut a little in here. Whoop. <laughs> so cool. Okay. So what's in here? Okay. There we have the there we have the speaker. Well, and you see from the speaker there goes the sound to the tube and then into your ear. Well, maybe let's cut one more time into this small thing here. Let's see what's hiding here. <laughs> well, okay, if you ask me what's this, I'll have to look it up by myself. I'm really not sure. However, I guess we've done a great job today. And well, thank you, here place, for the hearing aids. Thank you, Miss Jackson, for your old hearing aids. And well, I'm sorry, Miss Jackson. Okay, thank you. That was another episode of Dave the Hearing Aid Guy. If you like it, please leave a comment, give a like. Thank you. See you next time. Bye.